Now, Canada. Extraordinary what's been going on in Canada. The truckers' protest. We're now in day 10 of the truckers' protest. A state of emergency has now been declared in Ottawa. Um, and that's because the trucks, the crowds, are blocking Ottawa completely. Last Wednesday, I said to you that the Prime Minister had actually you know, been taken to a safe house. And I don't support mob rule. I don't support any use of violence. But perhaps you'll agree with me, these people look to be protesting pretty peaceably against vaccine mandates. And I believe they've got a right to do this. But an extraordinary twist to all of this is that GoFundMe, on GoFundMe, money was raised for the truckers' protest. They raised 8 million US dollars. And GoFundMe didn't like this. GoFundMe said that they support peaceful protests, but they believe the intention of the Freedom Convoy 2022 fundraiser, when it was first created, they now saw evidence from law enforcement that the previously peaceful demonstration had become an occupation with violence and other unlawful activity. And to begin with, they talked about giving the money to other charities. They're now going to refund it directly. So, folks, you pays your money, you takes your choice. Either you think GoFundMe a right to have done this on the basis that this occupation, frankly, is illegal and wrong, or you think, once again, this is big tech censoring what they see as something as being unacceptable. There is nothing, folks, unacceptable about saying you're against vaccine mandates.